Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nisha, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by and clicking that thumbnail and I hope you consider subscribing. To my old subscribers, thank you so much for coming back again. Guys, today I'm going to do a little house review and the house that I'm talking about is Theodoris Calatinis, okay? This brand right here. Guys, I first purchased Coffee Addict and I was so impressed with the quality of this fragrance that I had to place another order. Now, when I was placing that other order, the perfumer reached out to me and he said, you know, when you purchase this, I'm going to put some more goodies in the, the box for you. I'm like, okay, cool. So I'll get to sample other fragrances. Now, this man is so amazing. I was having problems with DHL and my package and all that, and he was on it. He was calling, he was doing whatever he had to do to make sure that I got my package. Guys, when I received my package, I was pleasantly surprised and so ecstatic that he gifted me with three, not one, not two, but three other fragrances and not samples, mind you. He gifted me three full-size fragrances so i paid for one and he was kind enough to send me three more if you're looking thank you so much for your generosity and for being such a amazing human being you and i had some mess, uh, conversations on dm and you were absolutely phenomenal in making sure that i get my package again thank you now guys this doesn't change my thoughts on these fragrances I purchased some and I got some and I'm going to be totally honest with you and let you know how I feel about them. Okay, so if you want to hear about this brand, please state. So Theodorus Calatinus is a Greek brand and I was reading up a little about the house and it says that from a little boy going to school, he would gather flowers and herbs and stuff and smell them. He would always love this from a young age. So I guess this was his passion growing up until he became perfumer guys um as i said it's a greek house and enough about that let's get into the fragrance the first and i made my notes okay i'm being very responsible and making my notes because sometimes i forget what i want to say and i'm like okay i'm going to test these out and while i'm testing them whatever comes to my mind i will write it down so that way you know yeah now i spoke about this fragrance already and this is coffee addict this is the most realistic coffee that i have smelled the notes are coffee caramel vanilla and cocoa pot guys this is a decadent rich coffee it is very distinct it's very sweet you get that caramel note as soon as you spray this and the vanilla it is delicious and guys you know sometimes coffee could be a little bit fleeting this coffee lasts throughout the lifespan of this fragrance. So it's not like it's going to pull a disappearing act on you. It's going to last the entire time. The coffee in this is very, very realistic. When you smell it, you can actually picture the coffee percolating and you're mixing it and you're getting that aroma. It is gorgeous. This is beautiful. Guys, I do not regret this one bit. If you are a coffee lover... Trust me when I say you need to try this. This is one of the best coffees that I've tried. Now, I love Intense Cafe and all that, but that is more vanilla and rose. You get a slight tinge of coffee, but you're looking for coffee, 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 coffee addict. The name is perfect. Check this one out and you thank me later. Guys, and on the website, there's always some sale or promotions going on. So wait for a sale. Hey, save your coins. Moving on to the other one. This other one is from a different collection. And this is the Golden Secret Collection, I think it's called. These are much more expensive than the Coffee Break. Not Coffee Break. <laughs> coffee Addict. So this one has the gold. Um, let me hope it for. There we go. The gold plate and a different bottle this is totally different to this so this one's a little bit cheaper this one is more expensive it's on the pricey side and this was this is called tobacco mania guys this one the top notes are tobacco tobacco leaf it has honey patchouli and vanilla guys this is 
very oh my goodness this is sweet it's a little bit powdery you get that tobacco but it smells like a fresh clean tobacco this guys it has that honey you definitely pick up the very prominent honey note in this it just sweetens the tobacco just right now this is not overly sweet but it's just done to perfection it has the tobacco as i said smelled so real this is very very long lasting all of his fragrances that's a given it's all very very long lasting from what i have and have tried not a problem this is very 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 beautiful if you're looking for that tobacco scent that more realistic tobacco sweetened with that honey it's just powerful but it's not too much a really gorgeous tobacco fragrance so get your nose on tobacco maniac gorgeous gorgeous fragrance moving on to the other one and this one is uh, come on focus there, there we go this is leather iris guys this thing is strong it will punch you in the face okay on the atomizer very nice this is a very strong leather iris fragrance it's very leathery it's like a rugged leather it's animalic and it's almost medicinal it is very very strong you get the iris the powderiness of the iris but you get that skanky leather you know it's a bit earthy this is an opulent leather and as i said it's a raw rugged manly leather this is not one of my favorites i cannot wear this by itself i'm being honest i this is not for me but if you're looking for a leather fragrance if you love leather now i like leather but not this strong this is a real rugged tough leather okay but guess what happened so while i was testing out my fragrances and making notes i had those little test strips that i was doing so when i grabbed it to smell this i smell something different I'm like what is it i ended up grabbing two strips one with the coffee mixed with this oh my goodness so i'm like wait a minute this smells amazing so i sprayed the leather first on my skin one spray of the leather and then i sprayed the coffee on top guys this mixed with the leather smells so good so that's how i can wear this the coffee with the leather um iris smells amazing together but just maybe one or two sprays of the leather because this is really really strong with the coffee so you get that nice balance so mixed together it smells amazing i would have never thought that i could mix them together it happened by mistake and that's how i can wear it because this by itself is too much for me i can't this one is too manly and it's too rugged so it mixed together gives a beautiful beautiful combination so try it if you have it and let me know as i said not too much of this and more of this huh, that was like a really good discovery because i'm thinking i can't wear that i i have to you know probably give it to my husband or something but girl that was good together moving on to i'll leave my favorite for the last i'll leave my favorite for last let's move on to this other one now this one is called royal orchid this one is just like coffee addict guys royal orchid so royal orchid when i this was the first one i tried after when i got my package and i'm like wow this smells amazing this is a nice spring summer scent in my opinion a nice date night scent as well a nice evening out it's rich and it's opulent it's sweet but it stands nicely it has depth and presence it's gorgeous so some of the notes of this uh, it has oud patchouli royal orchid cranberry so those are the notes that are listed you definitely get the patchouli and the sweetness from the cranberry that cranberry just sweetens up the whole thing and the sweetness from it it gets um i get a little bit of floral i guess it's from the orchid i really don't know how the orchid is supposed to i can't remember what orchid smells like but guys it's so sweet sweet almost syrupy um does orchid have a smell does it i can't remember anyways it's very nice 
it's sweet but it's almost tart at the same time oh my goodness this is so beautiful it's bright it's fresh but it's also deep i don't really smell the oud to be honest the oud like it's just day in the background just chilling just giving it some presence and, and some um some depth but i must say it's beautiful it's very fresh and sweet and as i said almost tart really really gorgeous fragrance and again long lasting so this one is called royal orchid beautiful summer scent i will be wearing this a lot for the as the weather is beginning to get warmer mm, really really nice so let's move on to my favorite one <laughs> guys this one is from the other collection that i spoke about like the leather and all that guys this one is santal wood listen if you love sandalwood you need this in your collection okay this is such a beautiful clean sandalwood guys oh my goodness this has a clean freshish kind of vibe stick oh my goodness oh my goodness hold on hold on hold on guys it's so good it's so good now the notes are patchouli oud sandalwood um labdanum listen can't pronounce these things this is very boozy okay my notes here i said it's very boozy it's woody to me it's a bit resinous yes i get that resinous quality from it but it has a freshness almost clean mm -hmm, that's what i said a hint of patchouli i don't get too much patchouli in this it's slight it has a leather note but it's slight again i don't really pick up that leather note guys this is absolutely stunning such a oh my goodness such a beautiful sandalwood this is my favorite from this collection so so gorgeous if you love sandalwood get your nose on this please you will thank me later and when i tell you this lasts so long you might be like oh i'm not smelling it you know you're not really smelling much of it but trust me when you move and you walk around you leave a scent trail there's a sillage to this it's beautiful people will smell you guys again my favorite this is one i purchased because i wanted this and he sent me the rest if you're looking again theodorus calatinis i hope i'm saying that right <laughs> Thank you so much for your generosity. I really appreciate it. So guys, these are the fragrances here. A whole bunch of them. I hope I have all my hands. Do I have any more? Yeah, all of these fragrances here. And the leather one is my least favorite. I don't really like this too much. But as I said, I mix it with a coffee. And I can make it work. It's not my favorite. Tobacco is really nice. And Santal Wood is my favorite. And of course, Coffee Addict and the other one. That's a different category. Guys, thank you so much for watching. And I hope I was helpful. And until next video, if you're not subscribed, hold up, hold up, don't leave yet. Wait a minute. If you're not yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button and share the love, okay? Join the Spicy Look family. Leave me a comment. Let me know if you've tried any of these. Okay, now you could go. Until next video, guys, be safe, be kind, and smell fabulous. Bye now.